All right, guys, third video for the day. What a sociopath. Crooked Ilmar just got caught raising money for a Minnesota food store and pocketing the cash. Allegedly. Now, the heading might be a little hyperbolic here, but let's jump into it. So, uh, she's only been in Congress for one term and already has been caught in numerous scandals, including immigration fraud, marrying her brother, allegedly, uh, which I do believe, and funneling money into her lover's consulting firm, which is also reported as well. Now, uh, you can add one more crime to the list. Ilma asked for donations this week to help feed Minnesota, uh, Minnesota food stores. As Minnesota struggles with hunger, I am partnering with Food Store and other local groups that pack and deliver meals to students and families. Chip in $5 to power their effort to keep their communities fed. So it seems like a good cause, right? Well, the problem is, is that Ilma's tweet was removed after the director of the organization that runs the Minnesota food store tweeted out a reply. I am the executive director of GMCC, Minnesota's food share is our program. Ilma had nothing to do with the project. I do not know where this money is going. Oh my god, Omar is a complete, you know what, what a crook. Um, yet another Elmar campaign finance problem. Um, posted this tweet Tuesday and then deleted it after some, um, uh, deleted it at some point after receiving this reply. Um, yeah, that's true. Look, at the end of the day, um, we don't know for sure that she was pocketing the money. Obviously, I have to be careful here. But what we do know is that she claims that she was partnering with them and other programs, and they had no idea about it. So, question was, where the hell was the money gone? And where did the money go? Look, at the end of the day, do I think she might have been pocketing some of the money? Sure. Chances are what she was most likely doing was funneling it through her own foundation who took a percentage off the top for admin, if I had to guess, and then maybe gave the rest of the money to some charities or something like that. But it would have been a way for her to skim off the top, if I had to guess. That would be my guess as to what was happening. Um, but look, at the end of the day, obviously, yeah, it's it's embarrassing. It's really bad that she's been caught. This is the, like, the third or fourth thing? That she's been caught being shonky over? Like... I, I, I don't know, guys. It's just... It, it's absolutely ridiculous what this woman can get away with. And, and no one seems to prosecute her. Like, is there any sort of investigation into this? Like, what, what the hell's happening with this? What, why can a politician go through and do this and get away with it? Oh, right, because of, yeah, minority status. Let's just double check the news. Um, I, I can't see anything here. I, I can't even see anybody mentioning this. Hmm. Because let me know your thoughts are in the comment section below. Just a very, very quick video. Personally, I'm not surprised. I'm really, really not. This girl's been caught doing so many shonky things in the past. I'm not surprised. Um, but let me know what your thoughts are in that comment section below. If this video has been helpful, please smack that like button. If you're new to the channel, welcome and subscribe. Apart from that, guys, this will probably be the last video for the day. There was supposed to be a fourth, but it's just getting too late to upload them now. Um, but yeah, I might do a live show maybe tonight, maybe. Um, stay tuned for notifications. Uh, apart from that, guys, obviously the video has been helpful. Smack that like button. If you're new to the channel, welcome and subscribe. 
Apart from that, guys, we'll see you in the next demonetized video from YouTube. Have a great day and enjoy.